Examining several situations will help to understand what you'd need to retire early. You can also use a retirement calculator to evaluate where you stand if you stick on your current path and how much money you need to retire early. But more crucially, you'll be able to spot areas for improvement and watch as your expected outcome improves. To different people, early retirement means something different. For some, it's simply a matter of eliminating a few years from their lives. Here are a few possible factors you should consider. Then, peruse these factors to get an idea of what it takes, or better yet, use an award-winning retirement calculator to figure out how you can retire early. So let's take a look. Welcome back to our Fiery channel. This is Fire. Here we bring you wealth tips, financial advice, cryptocurrency information, and updates on the financial world that you should definitely catch up with. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and ring that bell to get notified every time we upload a new video. We make sure we only bring you the best of content. In this video, we will talk about some factors you must consider to retire early and use the best calculator to find out how much money you need to retire. So make sure to listen carefully and enjoy. Share your thoughts in the comments below and watch till the end to find out how you can be financially independent, successful, and wealthy. Financial independence can be defined as having enough money saved and invested to meet your living expenses for the rest of your life. You can serve, work, or pursue hobbies or passions, but you won't be able to meet day-to-day -day expenditures or save for retirement if you don't have a job. The goal of the financial independence movement could be boiled down to, what would we do with our lives if we didn't have to work for money? For many people who stick to the mission, there is a savings target they want to hit, at which point they will have reached financial independence. It is called their FIRE number, and typically it is equal to 25 times a household's annual spending investing in low-cost passive stock funds. Many wannabe early retirees aim to save between $1 million and $2 million. For early retirement, the standard thinking is that a 4% annual withdrawal rate of your savings is safe and you can increase it by inflation each year. So for example, if you have saved $1 million, you can take out $40,000 in the first year. Then if inflation is 3% the following year, you can withdraw $40,000 plus 3% or $41,200. Of course, many factors come into play to determine how much you need to retire. So the first factor in the early retirement process is determining how much money you'll need to have in your investment portfolio to become financially independent. This is primarily based on what's known as the 4% rule. The theory behind the safe withdrawal rate holds that if your portfolio is invested in a mix of stocks and bonds, you'll be able to withdraw 4% of the portfolio each year without ever running out of money. Based on the safe withdrawal rate, the required size of your portfolio is 25 times your annual cost of living. Imagine you need $50,000 per year to maintain your desired lifestyle. Then, using the safe withdrawal rate of 4%, you multiply $50,000 by 25 giving you 1.25 million. That's how much money you'll need in your portfolio to produce the needed $50,000 annual income you'll need in retirement. Of course, getting to that portfolio size will require a series of strategies. Those strategies will include saving a large percentage of your income each month, then investing it at a rate that will produce the desired portfolio size. Secondly, lower your living expenses. For most people, you'll need to be able to save between 25% and 50% of your after-tax income 
to be able to retire in less than, say, 20 years. But of course, the exact percentage will depend on how much you'll need to reach your goal. So naturally, if you expect to retire in 15 years, the percentage will need to be higher. To do that, you'll need to cut your living expenses. That may involve more than just clipping coupons and eliminating unneeded subscriptions. More likely, you'll have to live in a home that's much less expensive than you can afford. You'll need to drive a much less expensive car. And you may need to forego expensive vacations, frequent restaurant meals, and hobby spending. The third thing to consider for early retirement is increasing your income. You may not have sufficient income to save such a large percentage for early retirement, or you may prefer not to cut your living expenses so dramatically. You may even choose to increase your income to enable you to reach your fire goal ahead of schedule. You can do so by starting a side hustle to boost your income. To give you a heads up, one of the best methods to go to fire is combining cutting your living expenses with raising your income. If you can save 50% or more of your after-tax income, you'll be well on your way to achieving your goal much sooner. Lastly, successful investing. If you're going to reach your retirement early goal, it won't be enough to put your money into a secure bank account earning 1% or 2% on your money, or worse, stashing it under the mattress earning no money at all. You will need to hold some money in safe income investments, but most will need to be invested in stocks. Based on the S&P 500, stocks have returned about 10% per year on average. That kind of return is the reason why stocks will need to dominate your portfolio. Naturally, there's more risk when investing in stocks than in safe bank assets, but the risk is minimized when you're investing for a decade or more. We're almost done with the video. What do you think so far? Let us know in the comments. Before revealing the second half of this video, please make sure to hit the thumbs up button and share fire with your friends. Spread the good news of financial independence and success. So guys, there's a lot that goes into calculating how much money you'll need to retire comfortably at a certain age. There are hundreds of aspects to consider some of which you may not have considered. When you retire, how much money will you spend? Will those costs fluctuate over time? What is the expected return on each of your accounts? Do you own a home? Do you have a source of passive income? This FIRE calculator will show you exactly how much you'll need to save to reach your early retirement goals. Also, you can tweak the rates to see how much extra you'll make through earning high interest on your investments. This calculator is to help you crunch the numbers that will be necessary for you to achieve FIRE status. Also, it can help you to create specific monetary goals and to know what steps you need to take now to reach those goals. To use the retirement calculator, you'll need to provide the following information. Your current age, after-tax annual income, yearly expenses and cost of living, current investment portfolio amount, yearly contributions towards your investment portfolio, your expected rate of return on your investments. You can use the slider to adjust the percentage. Your current savings account balance from all accounts, the percentage of income you contribute to your retirement savings, your savings rate of return, and your estimated retirement expenses on an annual basis, including income taxes. Once you've provided all the information, you can hit the Calculate button near the bottom. After that, you'll see your Retire Early goal, which is the amount of money you'll need to maintain your current standard of living once you've retired. The calculator will also give you your fire age, or the age you may expect to reach fire. So feel free to experiment with the calculator in different scenarios. For example, you may find that you need to make additional contributions to your investment and retirement accounts, or that you need to experiment with other rates of return. So before closing up, 
I want to show you the best investing platforms that would help you on your journey into FIRE. Wealthfront. Wealthfront is a robo-advisor providing complete investment management for a meager fee. That management includes automatic reinvestment of dividends, periodic rebalancing, and various strategies to minimize the tax liability generated by investment activity. You can open an account with just a few hundred dollars, making the service available for even the most minor investment portfolios. The annual management fee is also one of the lowest in the industry. One of the significant benefits they provide is broader portfolio diversification. While most robo-advisors concentrate on a mix of the U.S. and international stocks and bonds, which Wealthfront does, they also add real estate and natural resources to the mix, improving portfolio performance when stocks are failing. Wealthfront also allows for some customization to meet your FIRE goals on your own terms by adding and removing exchange-traded funds, also known as ETFs, of your choice. In addition, the Wealthfront cash account lets you set monthly expense and savings budgets, then sweep your account to route additional cash into your chosen investment accounts. This can add a lot of momentum to your investing power so you can meet your financial goals more quickly. So guys, let's wrap up today's video. Early retirement might seem like a dream, but it is one that you can achieve if you plan early and set goals as if your life depends on it. In fact, it does. The retirement calculator can help you determine how much money you need to retire earlier than you ever thought. You'll also learn at what age you'll be able to retire, which depends on how much you want to spend each year you're retired. To get to the point where you can retire early, you need to start investing. We also show you the best account to check out if you want to start investing today. All right, guys, we hope you enjoyed today's topic. We'd love to see how you improved and paved a path for yourself. Thanks for visiting our channel. This is FIRE, your channel on wealth tips, financial advice, cryptocurrency information, and updates on the financial world that you should definitely catch up with. If you liked this video, make sure to hit that like button and check out more videos like this one on the FIRE channel. Thanks for watching, and of course, see you in the next video.